Hello friends, today we will learn why geometrical tolerance required and definition of geometrical tolerance. Now observe dimensions of job. In case 1 and case 2, diameter and length of bolt is equal. Now observe geometrical shapes of job. In case 1, the bolt length is perpendicular to the bolt head, but in case 2, it is not so. Now the assembly, in case 1, it is being smoothly, but in case 2, it stuck. In case 2, by adjustment, if we do assembly, still there is a problem. Conclusion is that dimensional controls are not enough. Geometry also need to be controlled. Suppose we have to manufacture a circular cross section shaft of diatin with plus minus 0.5 deviation. Hence, acceptable maximum size will be 10.5 and acceptable minimum size will be 9.5. Now this blue ring is showing the tolerance zone. This is the cross sectional view of shaft which is lying in the blue ring. It means it is within limit. Hence as per dimensions it is correct but as per geometry it is not. Geometrical tolerance. The tolerance given to control the geometrical features within specified limit are known as geometrical tolerance. Geometrical tolerance refines the dimensional tolerances. Geometrical tolerances may be dependent or independent to some reference. So friends, if you like this video, don't forget to hit like and subscribe button.